So this is a logical and reasoning based question. There are 40 children standing in a circle. So child 1 has a ring. So the child 1 has a ring and the ring is passed clockwise. So that means after 40 children again it's going to be the first child. Okay, It goes on like that remember. And there is a pattern right here. So from child 1 it's passing to child 2. Then child 2 passed to child 4. Then child 4 is passing through child to child 7 and so on. So what is the pattern here? So you can see a pattern, right? This is plus 1, plus 2, this is plus 3, next will be plus 4, plus 5, goes on like that. So the question is asking you to calculate. After how many such changes, including child 1, so I need to add a child 1 as well, will the ring be in the hands of the child 1? So right now, the initially you start with child 1, I need to find after how many cha changes the ring will be back to child 1. That's it. So this is the first change. Okay, This is the first change. This is the second one. This is the third one. Goes on like that. I need to complete the pattern and see when is it after how many changes the ring is back to child 1. Okay, so since your answers are close by 14, 15, 16, 17, you should be very clear with the, uh, like, you know, try to avoid all the silly mistakes here. Otherwise, you'll end up marking the wrong answer. So, you understood the pattern. You can you just need to proceed further and see um, when is it going to be back to ch uh, child one. Okay, so let's write down, let's write down the pattern here. So, after that, 7, it's going to be plus 4. So, it's going to be 11 child. Then it's plus 5. It's 16. Then it's going to be uh, plus 6, it's uh, 22, then it's plus 7, which is 29, then it's plus 8, 37, then it's plus 9, okay, plus 9 means what, after 43, child after 3, it's 40, again it's back to 1, so it's going to be 6th child, it's a cycle. Keep that in mind, okay? The cycle. Again, it's going to be, uh, this is plus 9, plus 10, it's 16. Now, the like, you know, it's, it will uh, finish early because, you know, the, the difference is greater. Plus 10, the next is plus 11. So, it's going to be uh, 27. And then next is plus 12, which is uh, 39, right? Yeah, 39. Next is uh, plus 13. So after 40, it's again back to 1, right? So it's going to be 12th person, right? Again, I need to proceed until you are uh, getting 1 here, okay? Plus 14, it's going to be 26. Next is uh, plus 15, yes. 26 plus 15, after 40, it's plus 14 is 40. After that, one more, it's uh, 1. So yeah, the ring is back in child 1, back with child 1. So I need to find how many changes. So this is the first change, right? Second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. That's it. So it's clearly given that how many changes, including child one. So this also I need to include. That's what it's given in the question. So total fifteen changes happened here in this case, so that the ring is back with the hands of child one. So the answer is fifteen.